Here it comes. Here it comes. Dude, let's get a mosh pit going. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking love that song. I know, dude. Froymed. Hyrule Castle. What? Hyrule. I mean, yeah. Hyrule doesn't exist. Oh, it does. It's just, you know, it's Atlantis now. Like the Master Sword lost the power to repel evil, suggests that something has happened to the sages who infused the blade with the god's power. Yeah, Wind to Temple to the north, and Earth Temple to the south. Uh, neither of those were things in Ocarina. Yeah, no. In Ocarina, there was seven sages, but in this, it only focuses on two. Yeah. But it does it in a pretty damn cool way, where they're like ancestors of uh, uh, two characters we need for them. Yeah, but it's also... It's also the only appearance of a fucking Kokarina Zora. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's only one Kokarina. Which, like... It kind of bothers me that there's no Zoras in an ocean like this. Yeah. Like, I, I know that they've evolved into Rito, but they are fish people. Exactly. Why would fish people need to evolve in an entirely ocean-based world? Alright, uh... Oh, right, first thing. The... Oh, yeah, back to, uh... Mother Child. The Great Fairy. Yeah. Because now we can get the good shit. Because she's like, hey, you should... Meet up with, uh, somebody special, or whatever the fuck she said. We just, we just barge in at a bad time, she's like, ah, shit, shit, hide the stash! Uh, hey, buddy! What's up, bro? Can you, like, come back in five, uh, fifteen minutes? She has everything set up to film a porno. Oh, god, no. Please don't say that with this character. <laughs> she's right in the middle. She's behind the camera, don't worry about it. Oh, good. She's the one behind it all. Yeah. And then you get a special guest appearance by Lisa Ann. Lisa Ann? Yeah. She's a porn star. Okay. Tee hee hee. It seems the door to your fate has already swung open. Has it not? Yeah, that sounds natural. I wasn't filming pornos. <laughs> this isn't a sex doll I'm holding. Uh, Lisa Ann is the, the one from that video where she's like, Looks like you need a lifeguard here on your oh, beach. God. Please not that one. What are you talking about? This, this is a bathtub. Is a beach? This is a bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> Look out, a shark! Get out of the water! What this, no. <laughs> oh, good thing you had a lifeguard. <laughs> and then they fuck. <laughs> I fucking... <laughs> I love porn, dude. It's, I told, I told it's you the about, funniest shit in the world. I told you about the uh, gay porn clip I, before, right? Where like it's the two guys shooting pool, or whatever, and like one's behind the other, and he just goes, "Dude, your dick is hard. You're in a porno, dude." Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Become comedy at this point. I love it. It's the best. <laughs> Nothing's better than uh, funny shit that you can jerk off to. Yeah. <laughs> and then once you're finished stroking one out, you just think about the fucking scenario and how stupid it is. <laughs> because it's always stupid. What was what was one of the other dumb ones? Lemon stealing whores or something? Yeah. <laughs> Those lemon stealing whores. Yeah. So glad we planted that lemon tree. We haven't looked at it in a while, though. <laughs> Let's turn around and look at the lemon tree. <laughs> hey, what the fuck? <laughs> Get out of here, you lemon stealing whore! <laughs> <laughs> what are um, we doing now? Uh, we're going to the uh, fire mountain. All right, we need to get uh, what is it? Iron boots and what's the other one? Uh, mighty bracelets or whatever. Oh uh, yeah, called. yeah, yeah. Which I think the fire, the fire mountain has the mighty bracelets, and the uh, ring of ice has the boots. Uh, we also need to talk to Tingle about the triumph forks. Well, that's after we start gathering them. Yeah, don't we need to start gathering them? I think it's after, but I I usually do all that shit after the dungeons anyway. All right, now I gotta find the entry point before I do anything else. 
Uh, there. And arrow. Nope. Good. Whoops. Good. <laughs> Why do you keep fucking pressing the R button? I made a mistake. Hey, hey, hey. Fuck off. Oh, good motherfucker. Okay. Why do you there constantly press that? There we go. Freezing lava. Yeah, that's how cold these arrows are. That's pretty fucking bad. I don't even think Sub Zero could freeze lava. What about Elsa Frozen? Elsa Frozen. Yeah. Do you think she could freeze lava? Uh, I think so, maybe. I don't know. Who's the most- I've, I've never seen the extent of her powers. Yeah, me neither. Uh, I just know that she froze an entire kingdom. Uh, I definitely don't think Sub-Zero could freeze lava. Yeah, definitely not. Yeah. Just as much as I think that Sub-Zero- or not Sub-Zero, uh, Scorpion can't really control lava. And, like, he has it in some of his attacks, no. I think. Sub-Zero can't freeze lava, and Scorpion can't melt ice. That's where they're constantly in conflict, and it has nothing to do with their ninja heritage or whatever. Also, the fact that Scorpion can't melt ice is the stupidest thing. <laughs> <laughs> because ice is so easy to melt. Yeah, right? You just have to hold it, and it's like, ah, jeez, ah, ah. I like the idea of Scorpion being an idiot. Again, just <laughs> any video game character that we play as. Yeah. They're just dumbasses. And there it is. Cool dungeon. Yeah. Well, out of the two, this is the fucking easiest one. The ice one, the slip and slide, is not so good. But it is funny. Power bracelets. So now, we can do cool shit like this. And, if I spin around... Hello, child, this is me! <laughs> I am now with legs! Can you move? No, I can't. Oh, that sucks. I know! <laughs> I want nothing more to be walking around with this fucking thing. No, just walking towards the camera. Where are you going? <laughs> Come back! I have not spoken to anyone in over 5,000 years, please! And now the fire mountain is forever shut down. Alright, so now we can uh, go back to Outset and do that. Pit of a hundred trials. Yeah, we can. And we can get that triumph for it. Let's see. Yeah, I think that's it right there, actually. Maybe. Let's find out. Yeah, maybe we should fill out this map. And yeah, maybe we should uh, shut up. Do not question the master of the Zorda games. You hurt my feelings. You don't have feelings. Mm. <laughs> you been to this one? I don't know. See, this is why you should, uh... Fill out the map. Fill out the map. Fill out the map, yeah. Because then we would know. I think, actually, I have everything I need to get into all of them. Yeah, we've been in this one. Mail, though. We got cash on delivery. Oh, you... yeah, that's, that's <clears> Tingle. <throat> that's Tingle. You heard we were looking for the Triumph Forks, and he's like, oh -ho! This fucking voice. Uh, how much bait do we have? I don't know. We have two things of bait. Is it regular bait or master bait? <laughs> <laughs> Nintendo would have something called master bait. No, they wouldn't. Well. Nintendo would never fucking do that. You don't know. I do know. You know nothing on Nintendo. They have a fucking leader called Bowser now. That's true, Doug Bowser. <laughs> yeah. I'm honestly wondering if that is his actual name or if he had it changed to that. No, that's his name. Okay. Uh... No, I mean like if he was born with it. Yeah, that's his name. Wait. His parents must be cool. <laughs> but, um, speaking of masturbate... What are you doing? Don't worry about it. Do speaking of masturbate, mm -hmm. it reminds me of, uh, something I heard about, uh, DC Comics. Where, uh, Neil Gaiman, who wrote... What was it called? Sandman? Uh-huh. It's, it's like, epic graphic novel, whatever. So when he was writing it, he asked, like, DC executives or whatever. Or, no, he he wanted to put in a reference to uh, masturbation. <laughs> okay. And uh, one of the DC executives said, hey, you, you can't do that. And then he's like, why? Because no one in the DC universe masturbates. And Neil Gaiman says, that explains a lot about the DC Universe. <laughs> <laughs> Link, calm down. 
Yeah, right? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Into the mouth of the ice dragon. Ice dragons are cooler than fire dragons. Literally and figuratively. I don't get it. Is this Batman's place or Mr. Freeze's? Uh, Mr. Batman Freeze. Whoa, Holy fuck. Whoa. There we go. Yeah, not that hard, but I definitely prefer the Power Mountain. Which is weird, because, like, usually if it's like, do you choose fire or ice? I usually go for ice, but I hate this place. Yeah, that's because Articuno is the best. Articuno is pretty damn good. And what are you going to do? Go with Moltres? <laughs> what are you, some, some kind of some kind of not good person? 